What is up, guys? What have you got? Hey, commentary, come on out, chill. Let's see if I can hear. Okay, there we go. But here's some recruiting. We got we're first with Jeremy Riley and Jason Thomas. So I know we got a lot of sons in the back. Josiah Thompson. I really kind of am torn between them because I don't want two Thompson on the team. And the one guy I really want is JJ Thompson. So that's kind of like a hard decision to make because it's like I really want. I really want Josiah Thompson, Thompson as a, because he will be a very good backup, but I'll probably just go for someone else with a different name, because I just don't really like that. But we're scouting him. Ooh, 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 whoa. Usually three down arrows. That's a fourth one. Okay, he just lost a lot of minus one only. Okay, that's not that bad. He's just a 70 overall. Josiah Thompson, we're fourth on his list. We might not even get him, depending on what he's looking at right now, but you're J.J. Thompson, 85 catch in traffic, 83 acceleration, 84 jumping, 75 catch, 88 spectacular catch, and 83 speed, he's a boss, with also 84 release, he probably will piece it up next season, but here's A.J. London, he's soft committing to Iowa, we do not want to lose this guy, this guy, <clears throat> Is really gonna help us next year, but AJ London, you're gonna have to check that out next week to see if we pick up AJ London. I would really love if we could pick up AJ London. And now here we're looking, we're just gonna pick up Brian Smith and a couple other guys. Actually, we didn't even pick him up. Well, yeah, we're gonna pick up a couple guys for us. For a, a couple cornerbacks, since where we might, if we lose, since that guy's soft committed, we just really want to have some other people. But we're also going to take Aaron Wilson. Hope he can take this spot after Walker May leaves town and try and pursues whatever he wants to, whether that be the NFL or something other than that. We don't know, but here we go. Let's go. Yes. Columbia, South Carolina is where we'll be today, taking on the number 18 South Carolina Gamecocks with Marcus Lattimore and Connor Shaw. <clears throat> Let's go. Kick Stephen Clark on the return. Stephen Clark gets some blocks, and he <coughs> is taken down after a decent game. And you see in the Big 12, Oklahoma losing to Texas. <coughs> That's a good game over there, but who is not, it all only matters, well, the only thing that matters is this game. This game only, number 18, South Carolina, handoff on Norman, two-yard gain. Just gets absolutely trampled. The Carolina defense is faster than us, stronger than us, smarter than us. Can we pull off the upset today? This will be the biggest win by far if we can upset the number 18 team in the nation. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. We're switching the point. Perry Tillman, second and eight. <laughs> Drops back to pass. It's Wesley Matthews for the first down. Third and six. Come on. Shoot him out. Ow. It's absolutely deafening down there. Third and six, and we are lucky. Trying to Wesley Matthews. Almost picked off. That would have been a very scary moment. No turnovers this game. That's all we ask of Perry Tillman, and we have a legitimate chance. Hand off. Marcus Lattimore. Spin move. Breaks a tackle, and there goes Marcus Lattimore down the sideline. There he goes, touchdown Gamecocks. What a run by Marcus Lattimore. I believe he's a senior. This guy is one of the best running backs in college football. Other than, I think, Monty Ball, who just is going to the draft. But there's Jadavion Clowney and the rest of the Gamecocks. 
He has taken everyone by stride for that hit on that Michigan guy. That was ferocious. But now here Connor Shaw, third and five. Loading up for A. Sanders. It's incomplete. So looks like they're going to have to settle with the field. It's 10 nothing. South Carolina, 246 left in the first quarter. Oh, here we go. Some adjust, adjust. Here he go. Screen play. And Jadavion Clowney goes out and gets Wesley. Warren Norman, sorry. What a play. And look at the field goal. Usually that's going to hook way right. <clears throat> Apparently not today. Not today. They'll take over at the 20 yard line. <clears throat> Sorry, but there you go. They actually got another field goal. Hey, now we got a hit off Warren Norman. He got the box. Spin move. And Warren Norman to tell you that's a touchdown, Bandy. There we go. Great blocking. Great spin move. And he's gone off by his way for a touchdown. No Jadavion Clowney on that one. <clears throat> You are too short, you got, got you, got you, Davey, you just kidding. But here we go, second and nine. <clears throat> uh, option play, and it's the fop, the backwards pass is stolen by the future freshman, I'm telling you, Jeff Brooks. It was an option, and look at that, Jeff Brooks read it the whole way, took it from Marcus Lattimore, and he went to pay, no one was going to catch him. What a way, what a play, for Bandy gives them the, we have the lead in Columbia, South Carolina, but not for long, Marcus Lattimore, Chase Garham, and the rest of the Bandy team. Fans is there to rally for the stop. We are really doing work right now. Third and goal. Can we get a stop? Connor Shaw. Oh, die it there. Here comes David Weatherly. Get down to the turf, son. That's a sack for Steven Weatherly. What a play. He gets very little playing time, but when he does, he, go, he does it big, and especially against Connor Shaw in the 18th ranked South Carolina Gamecocks. Doing really good right now. Very proud of the team. Doing work. There we go. They get a field goal, and they take the lead back in South Bend. So it's second and two. The routes are all crazy because we're in South Bend. And Perry Tillman goes up, and Josh Grady goes up and gets it. What a play. That was ridiculous. Look at this throw. Great throw. And look at Josh Grady. No fear goes up and gets it. Now Jadavion Clowney. And now here Marcus Lattimore. Two spin moves. You don't see that very often. And people get away. And the running back gets a 10-yard gain. But anyways, second and inches. We're going to get a toss play. Marcus Lattimore breaks a tackle. And Marcus Lattimore sprung out again. Kenny Lather saves the day. But Marcus Lattimore almost had another long touchdown. Lather. Kenny Lather saves a day for Randy. Counter Shaw sets up Shaw. Throws one up. And Anderson somehow gets out jump Lattler and gets to the two yard line what a throw and catch by Anderson doing work and now it's first and goal 155 left in the second quarter South Carolina looking to increase their lead uh, Wildcat playing Marcus Lattimore going nowhere no no, sir, not today. <clears throat> but yeah, I want to make the push for Jeff Brooks Friday. And then Jeff Brooks causes a football. It was a backwards pass. Jeff Brooks couldn't, was trying to make the pick. 
knocks it down and we recover, but they get the ball back. And here's A. Sanders, the star wide receiver. And he finds his way to the end zone. A. Sanders breathes life into a South Carolina fan base. Wow, boy. And they get, we did get a touchdown before it happened. Now we get the ball back. Third and six. Huge stop if we get one. And we do. On Connor Shaw. I guess the pressure got to him. He didn't get hit, but he could feel it and got him rattled. And he throws it away. On to the punt. Or no punt, actually. Okay. Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Fourth and six. I don't know if I'm gonna actually show this pump play. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Now you go second and 13. Play action. Big Perry Tillman by Steven Chu for the first down. That's very nice. That's a very nice throw and catch. We want to see more of that. More often. Nice play. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. And now here, play action fake again. Oh, Perry Tillman, load it up. He's got Wesley Matthews, the senior, freshman, the senior. This is the most, the biggest, most lethal connection Vandy has seen in their two years as Nick Foster at head coach. Look at that throw. He loaded it up and found Wesley Matthews, the senior. Coming up huge. Watch to leave his impression on Vandy. Does Wesley Matthews, the star player, pulling this team, get doing what he can to ensure the W? But will it be enough? Third and eight. Connor Shaw. All day in the pocket. Loads up at Darius Bailey. The freshman. You haven't heard much of him this year. But we did pick him up as one of our athletes last year. And he is going to be the starter next year after Kenny Lowler uh, graduates. But South Carolina ties it. And they got the ball back in field goal territory. 6.56 left in the fourth quarter. Motion man, Connor shot once again all day in the pocket. Loads up and what a play. That is top 10. ESPN top 10 as right there. He fits it in between three defenders almost, I think. Three defenders. Connor Shaw, what a throw he gets it. That is first round NFL quality throwing and catching right there. But thank you guys for watching this video. Come back next time. We're going to be taking on Kane Coulter and the Northwestern Wildcats. We did drop down a 500, but we looked to bounce back against Kane Coulter, just like I said. And the Northwestern Wildcats, that's going to be a good one. Until then, this is the Gamers Nation side. Now subscribe. Hope you like the new mic. Hope it sounds better. Until then, this is Gamers Nation. Don't subscribe. Peace.